What's up YouTube? This is Mr. Olympia part 2, so I'm gonna give you a quick recap of what happened Saturday night at the 2014 Mr. Olympia. So I'm gonna talk to you about the top 6, then I'm gonna give you my opinion on if Phil deserved his victory or not, and then I'm gonna tell you why I think a lot of people were rooting for Kai this year. So just before starting, I just wanna say that Flex Lewis won his third consecutive Mr. Olympia in the 212 category, so that's a pretty big thing too. He's starting to be unstoppable. So, the top six. Number six, Brent Warren make his big comeback in the top six. He, fl he's fin he, fin he finished at place number nine last year, and he got a crazy conditioning this year. He deserved his sixth place, and uh, yeah, he beats Big Ramy because Big Ryan wasn't in condition at all, so congrats to Branch. Then fifth place, Dexter Jackson, awesome shape, awesome physique. I mean, I think he's just the most aesthetic bodybuilder, um, and it just seems like he isn't aging. He's like more than 40 now, and still have an awesome physique. Um, number four, Dennis Wolf, uh, crazy conditioning too, maybe the best with Branch. A uh, good place, but uh, he looked real disappointing at the end. But I think um, that's he, he deserved his fourth place. Then Sean Roden, number he he came out uh, three a third, uh, pretty big physique, really full, uh, defined, maybe his best physique ever. But it wasn't just enough to compete with the top two. And number two, I don't know, Kai Green, he was a lot better than Friday night. His conditioning was a lot better. I think he lost a lot of water between uh, Friday and Saturday. He was real good, and it was a really, really close battle with Phil. And so, first Phil, no big change compared to Friday night. I mean, great physique. I have to say, it's great physique. But I was disappointed. I think in 2013 his physique was better. I think it was just his best physique ever in 2013 and uh, yeah, his abs weren't really defined this year and his stomach even looked a little bit bloated, so I was disappointed. So uh, do, do I think he still deserved to win? Honestly, yes. And that's why, even if it wasn't his best, I think he was still a little bit better than Kai, especially on Friday. Kai, I mean, there's a huge difference between the Kai Friday and Saturday. Saturday the battle was close, but Friday feel was better, so I think he deserved to win. But in general, I'm pretty disappointing, disappointed. Excuse me, um, of the this Olympia. I mean, Phil and Kai weren't at their best, and uh, their physique were just better last year. So yeah, pretty disappointing. Now, what I think, even if Phil won, a lot of people think Kai is the better, and uh, Kai received the Fans, Fans Choice Award. Um, I think ju that's just history, you know? People are like that. I remember a lot of people loved Ronnie Coleman, a lot of people. And now, then he, deserved, he started to win a lot of time, win again, again, and again. And people just get bored, so a lot of his fans became Jay's fan, and then all those people were rooting for Jay. And when Jay, when Jay won, they were so happy. And then Jay won again and again, and those same people started rooting for Phil, so they became Phil's fan. And now Phil is winning one, two, three, four times. People get bored and and search for a new contender. So that's why a lot of people. Are rooting for Kai. I mean, the, the, people love to see some kind of real life movie, you know, with a super superhero versus a super villain, and like they like to see this bad guy who's rich and gifted. I mean, like Phil, and the other guy who works hard, who work his ass off to to succeed. And I think that's why a lot of people are rooting for Kai. But if Kai win, like two three years. People are just starting to, to, to like some, somebody else. That's how it is. And that's, I think, it always will, will, will be like that. So yeah, I don't know if people really think 
Kai is better than Phil or if they just want another guy to win because they like change, you know? So yeah, that's it. I have to say it was a pretty disappointing Olympia. I hope it's gonna be better next year with why not a few new faces. So let me think what you thought about this Olympia and comment to, to let me know if you think Phil deserve or not his victory. So share this video, like it, and most important, subscribe to my channel, please, and I will see you in the next video.